Hey everybody and welcome to my usual me and welcome to the Genesis map brought to you by People's Gaming and Twitch RP. Alrighty guys, so it's on Steam right now, so you can go ahead and download this map anytime you want. And I suggest you, I highly suggest you do so because it has everything and from every DLC. I'm really, really super happy to be here, and so uh, we're checking it out. That's a tech city right there. Hi, Monogard. Hi. <laughs> Did I catch you unawares? <laughs> Were you sleeping? Uh -huh. yeah, wake up, Monogard. Anyway, guys, so look, if you guys, so right here, we are at, let's see, where are we? Uh, ba -da -ba -da. We're at 44.5 by 49.9. There's a mountain right here, guys. And watch out for this, this mountain, okay? I just lost a pteranodon not too long ago because at the top of this mountain is the world ceiling. If you try to get up to the top of this mountain, let's get out here so I can show you. Our base rate is right over there, guys, dead ahead. But this mountain, if you get to the top of it, be careful because that's the world ceiling. And the world ceiling is basically at the top of that, that cube right there. That's a force field, by the way, if you didn't know. We're going to show you the city in a future episode, so don't worry about it. We're going to get in there, and we're going to get our hands dirty. So, But I lost a pteranodon. I went through the world city. I was able to parachute down through the world ceiling myself, but... I was told that it used to delete your character, so be very careful when you're up there. I mean, don't go all the way up. So go around, skirt your way around. He's going to fix it, but that's after he gets some of the stuff in. So, oh, there's a yellow drop on a guard. I want to get it. I want to get it. There's so much here. Oh, there's all these raptors and stuff. Oh, no. All right, we're going to get it. We're going to be fast. Oh, come on. Uh, not worth it. Not worth it. Laser attachment and a uh, blueprint for a metal door or window. So, all right, guys, we're going to show you today where to find oil, real oil, not just oil from a fish. So we're going to go ahead and go right down in here. And there's the tech city, like I said. We can kind of, we can do a flyby. Yeah? Yeah. Kind of a flyby here. You can't get into it with flyers, period, end of story. There's only two ways in. One in the front, one in the back. There's a front entrance and a back entrance. Watch this. I hit this, boom. Stops me cold. There's no way in around this force field, but you can we can we can put our nose against the fishbowl though. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Uh -huh. And I say tech city, it's more like a sci-fi city, guys. The obelisk is in the middle, which is really cool. Really cool. There are dinos in here, guys. And I, I think you can actually you can actually take walking mounts in here, I've been told, but not flyers. So uh, we're going to go inside. You should be excited because it's going to be pretty cool when we go there. So, But we're not going to do that today. Today we're going to find oil. It's a resource, uh, it's a resource uh, episode, so here we go. I'm going to go ahead and take you to where I'm getting my oil from right now. There's a couple of other spots that have multiple nodes, but right now the oil doesn't bleed like it does on the other maps. He doesn't have that effect in yet, so it will eventually be put in, I think. But for right now, not so much, not so much. So we're going to go up this right now. Let me show you where the map is right now. All right, so we're going up this canyon right here. And I'm, am I right, Monogard? I'm right, right? I think so, yeah. I think, I think this, this is, is it. it, yeah. I remember the floating yellow flowers. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So you see the floating yellow flowers on the back side of, of the Twitch RP city. And we're going to go, and we're going to land right here, I think. This is a good place to land. Watch out, then. There's Pegos here. Hang on. I'm going to put my, these mushrooms in that. There we go. He can have all the mushrooms he wants. All right, so... Now, be careful, man. There are plenty of sharks and mantas down in here. There were. Wait, wait. Oh, this is not it? This isn't it. Are we in the wrong spot? Is it the next area down? Wait, did we miss it? I think so. We're close to it, according to the map. No, this is it. This has to be it. Yeah. Jump over here. Let me see what we got here. Yeah, here we go. This is it, guys. It's been between these. Uh, these two nodes are in between these two flower beds here, and they're they're right there. I don't need any oil right now, so I'm not gonna bother getting them. But this is the two safe ones. Okay. Oh, safe-ish. I shouldn't say really safe. 
So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and take a chance. I brought my scuba gear. We're gonna jump in here right quick, and I'm gonna go ahead and show you the other five or four or whatever they're in this canyon. And they're in this. What is it? I don't know what it, what you call it. Tributary. I don't know. I don't know what you call it. But there's a manta there. Another manta there. Another manta there. Oh God. Oh God. I'm stuck. Okay. What's that? What's that? You say? Shark? You say? Yeah. There's one there. Okay, there's another one there. All right, we got, oh my God. Okay, there's another oil node, another oil node there. There's another oil node here. You can come down and grab them. You can, you can grab them. So the way, is there five oil nodes here? Maybe there might be another one in here somewhere maybe. But I am not gonna stick around to find out if I can get them if I'm fast enough because we don't need the oil. So I'm just gonna go ahead and we're gonna just do this. I'm gonna jump out. There is five oil nodes right there for you guys. And that is, once again, I'm gonna back out of here because I don't trust it. At 15.6, 73.4, okay? This canyon right here. It's on the back side of the city. So you can see the obelisk right through that, right through that canyon right there. All right, so there's a purple drop. I might want to get that purple drop, but not right now. We're gonna go ahead and grab this and that, and we're gonna run back to our bird, and I'm gonna show you the next spot where you can find some oil. All right, guys, well, location number two is going to be right here. It's going to be at 12.7 uh, by 84.6. This is the actual, actually, in episode one, guys, one of the spawns that I was at, East One, is right across the way. Remember where I got killed by the raptor right over there? Right over there, guys. Boom. Right there is where I got killed by that raptor in episode one. So you actually have, I see some oil down in here. Let's get our gear up and let's see what we can do here. There's a lot of baddies in here once again, so be careful. All right, so there's an oil node there. That's an oil node one there. That's two. Oh, it's ichthys. Um, I said earlier there were pearls. There are pearls down in here, which is really cool. There's a lead sith right ahead of me. Um, dun, dun. Dun 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 Alright, right, there's another oil node there. There's another one there. So that's four so far that I've seen. Um at least four. Looks like at least four oil nodes that I can see guys. So definitely another another batch of oil for you guys and some pearls here. So this is actually a pretty viable spot for you to, to build a base. You just gotta watch out. I would tame a I'd tame an ichthy. Is what I do. I tame an ichthy, train it up, maybe tame a shark, and, and clear the bay. That's what I would do. And then you could have all the oil and, the, and pearls that you need for your electronics and such. So there you go. All right, let's go to location number three. If I can find my tyr my pteranodon, where's my pteranodon at? Monogard. What? Uh, oh, hot, hot, hi. How are you? All right, guys. Well, the third and last location is actually going to be right where you put your fingers. So you know, if your fingers are on the map, that's why you can't see it. Um, you know, so just go right where your, where not your pinky is. Actually, yeah, we'll go where your pinky is and then head west. So that's pretty much it. So and it's in this line of water right here is where you're going to find it. So let's go ahead and jump into our gear one more time, one last time. And we're going to go ahead and we're going to get in this water and get, get our feet dirty or wet dirty and wet oh my god there's a lot of sharks in here my guard there's a lot of sharks um there's some a whole bunch of oil in here guys though a whole bunch i'm afraid that i'm gonna be um am i faster than a shark oh uh, yeah I hope you just are. barely i got a whole bunch of them around there's two another leads there's a lot of leads on this map guys hopefully he scales it back a little bit there's a lot of leads there so careful with your um okay i don't see much over on this side but we're gonna go ahead and get out of this water because I think that I'm gonna I would probably die pretty quick if they caught up with me. So, but there are there is some oil in this in this water, guys. So if you're looking for oil, a third spot, this is where you want to be. And I'm gonna get out of this water right now, right now. Oh my goodness. Woo! All right, everybody. Well, I hope that helped you out with finding your oil on the map. Is this going to be the only location to find oil? I don't know. I don't think so, but it might be. But then again, that's three locations, man. I hope that helped you out. If it did, give us a thumbs up. If you liked the video, and if you haven't subscribed, do that right now. As I always say, I am my usual me. You be your usual you. We'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. You want to say goodbye, Monogard? Goodbye. Bye, guys. Woohoo! 
I'm excited for the next one.